Mail for Mac has borrowed some multi-touch gestures from Mail for iOS. If I select an email here, I can now swipe slightly with two fingers to the left to bring up a trash button. Then click to delete the email. Do a full swipe to the left to delete the email without needing the extra click. Here's a video of the two different swipes. The first is just a quick, short swipe to bring up the trash button. The other is a longer swipe that will trash the email right away. Swipe to the right on a message to quickly mark it as read or unread. Again, I can do a short, quick swipe to access the button, or a longer swipe in order to avoid having to click the button. Next, we're going to put mail into full screen mode. In previous versions of OS X, you could only work with one email message at a time while in full screen. Now in El Capitan, you can have multiple emails up in tabs. So if I click the reply button with a message selected, a new message is going to come up. If I were to then decide to compose a new message while I'm putting together that reply, I can click off of the message to access my inbox. Then click the compose button and a new blank message comes up in a second tab. So now I have a tab containing the new message and a tab with the reply from earlier. I can go back out and reply to another message if I like, which will give me three tabs. Send one of these and that tab goes away. It's also possible to manually close the tabs or move them around by click and drag. If you enjoy using apps full screen, these features are going to let you use mail at full screen pretty much all the time now. Rather than before, when while in full screen in mail, you couldn't really work on more than one email at once. The MacU.com provides in-depth video tutorials on how to use your Mac, iPad, and iPhone. Start a free trial today to see all the lessons on topics like Mac OS Sierra, iOS 10, the Photos app, Safari, Calendar, and many more.